Hi, welcome to the Let Me Tech channel. My name is Ryan and you are watching part 2 of how to reinstall Windows 10 back onto the Lynx 1010 or 1010B tablet with drivers. Let's get straight into it. So now it is time to go ahead and install the drivers. So all we need to do right now is go into Windows Explorer right down here on the file manager. And we want to go to view all the way up this top by here, click on view. And make sure file name extensions is ticked. Then go to this PC, take out your keyboard. Hmm. Hold on. Oh, never mind, that was my mouse. So, like I was just saying, take out your keyboard and plug in your USB again. You should get a message like this asking to open it up, but if you don't, just go into Windows Explorer and click on what you named your USB. Now we want to go into the, this drivers folder which we created and in this box up here actually you know what let me try to zoom in oh wait yeah my mouse is connected in it hold on Okay, I don't know how to zoom in right now, but so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to grab it. So up there where it says search drivers, right there, right up here, you just want to type in dot .inf, no spaces. Hold on a minute though. What I well, what we have to use for this is we need to use the on screen keyboard, unfortunately. So if I click on your start button, uh, let's go to taskbar and go to show key touch keyboard option. Then go to search drivers up there in the search box. Tap on the touch keyboard with the mouse. And type in, like I was just saying, dot. I N F and then close out the touch keyboard. By the way, you also don't want to have any spaces or capitals, just dot I and F. Then click on all of them. If I click install. Yes. And you literally want to do this with all of them in a row. So like this. Right click install. Yes. Right click install. Yes. Right click install. Yes. And you literally want to keep going down the list and doing the same thing. Right click. Yes. Left click on the one underneath. Right click on it. Install. Then click yes if you get a prompt. So I'm going to speed through this process right now using the magic of software and computers. So 3, 2, 1, speed up. After we are all installed, you'll probably get like a bunch of these um, blue eye messages. Just go through them. If they say restart, click on restart later. And if any of them say operation completely successfully, basically just click on the X like I am doing. And apparently it's not going to let me do that. It's going to get annoying. Oh, there we go. After it all throws out, click on the start button, power, restart. And of course, wait for it to restart.
So now, here's my finger, here's the screen. Touch is working, password is working, let me just type it in. Oh, it doesn't want to type in, that's odd. Right, hold on, let me just turn it away from, from you. I'm sorry about this, but I kind of got to type in my password. Okay, so now as we see what we've got working is hopefully the rotation is working. Let's give it a try. Rotation is working. Hold on a minute. As we can see there, the sound is working. Touch screen is working. What is the weather like? Right now, it's nine and raining. So there we go, confirmed, microphone and the sound are both working. Battery indicator is working, I don't know if you can see that. Let me zoom in quickly. So what we've got down here is we've got a battery indicator which is working. We've got the Wi-Fi which was already working, we've got the sound. Look at that, even swipe dressers are working and I'm hoping, no, we've not installed them, eh? Okay, so, <laughs> So, I really hope you enjoyed that video. My name's B. Ryan, this is the Libertech channel. And tomorrow I'll be showing you how to move Windows install location to another folder such as your documents or your pictures or if you want your music or an SD card or a USB drive. You know, the install location where usually when you like install a game or a program such as Grand Theft Auto 5 or whatever or Steam or any any program whatsoever but I'll be showing you how to change the location of where that actually gets installed too. So keep your eyes peeled for that. That will be coming out around 6 to 8 p.m. UK time. But so that's been all from today and I will see you tomorrow. So if this video helped you in any way whatsoever, then don't forget to bruise the like button with your fists, smash the subscribe button with a hammer and leave a comment below comment box is below the description so what are you waiting for? Go comment!